Hey, welcome to today's tutorial where we're gonna learn We Ended Up With The Girl by Happiness. First things first, it's a two-part series and today we're gonna learn what Johnny, um, the bassist, does. If you guys would like the other one, which is what um, Benji, yes, I'm flexing that I know all the band names, <laughs> um, does the, uh, the lead and the solos and all that, please tell me down below. At the end of the video, there are a bit more advanced techniques that I think really adds to the song. And this kind of can just cement everything we already know. We are going to start with the shape. And what we're going to do is we're going to put these two fingers on the D string, on the 2nd and 4th fret, and plant our middle at the top. We're also going to mute the A string, and that's kind of going to complete everything for what we're going to do next. Let's move on into the picking pattern. So, the picking pattern, we're going to use alternate picking. We're going to start with the E, and we're going to hit three times. Then we're going to hit the D, go back to the E, and then hammer on on the D, and hit it one more time. I think we're making big progress, and you can see the song coming through, but it's not exactly perfect. And what Johnny does is that he now introduces the mu of the string. So what we're going to do is we're going to split up that three times we're playing the E, and instead give one to the A string that's muted. And let me show you how that looks. What Johnny does is that he starts with the one, two, three, and then for the rest of the three times, he plays the meter one. Let's move on into the other shapes. We're going to move this whole rhythm down a string. So instead of pressing the E string three times, we're going to press the A string three times. So one, two, three, then you can hit it three times again or twice. And then I like to hit the E string one more time and then hit the A string twice once we put down our finger on the third fret. And then we're gonna finish with... So, let's move on into the playthrough. We're gonna attack the bridge. So first things first, we kind of use a different picking pattern. Before we used alternate picking, but now we're gonna use alternate picking but between these two fingers. And this is how it's gonna look like. So we start here. Then we move from here. And then we're gonna go back to picking the, the bass first and then the higher note. And this time, we're going to pick our, our A string and our D string. Notice that my middle finger was at the top of the string, the top of the third string, just not playing anything. And that's going to be useful because we're going to plant it down here and go... And that's how the first part of the bridge looks. Now, let's add it with the second part and then move on to the playthrough to try and get everything that we learned. Okay, so, we're going to start here. We're going to play, instead of playing the G, we're just going to play the D. So, we're going to play the D. Then everything else is the same. Sorry about that. We are almost done with the song, but I know that you guys want the extra sauce on this one. So we're going to go through a few things that he does in the normal one and then the picks along and yeah, those are the versions. So first things first is the two licks that the guitar plays that the bass mimics and this is what they are. So our first lick is... Let me show you how that looks like. So it's now let's move on into the second one, and 
And what we do is, we're going to start here. So what I did was, we started on the A string. And we went two frets up. Then we slid all the way here. Did a bit of a vibrato. And went back here. And that's basically it. Okay, bye bye with the F1 too. Because we're the, we're the cool kids, okay? And that is the end of the video. I know you're not supposed to say that on like YouTube laws, but I, yeah, I, I wanna go eat. Yeah, I wanna go eat. I'm waiting for you to leave. Okay, I'm gonna eat. <laughs>